It's Saturday, it's a holiday weekend, and I had no clue what kind of video I wanted to make today. So I just thought I would ramble for a bit about a topic that is probably the most boring topic I've ever covered. And that is to ask this question. How often should you restart your computer? Because this is an answer, or this is a question I should say, that no one really knows the answer to. And I think it's different depending on what operating system you use, because I think if you use Windows, you probably should start restart your computer more often. Uh, but that might just be my anti-window voice in the back of my head that is always screaming uh, in pain. Uh, <laughs> biasing my you know response to the question i don't know uh, it, on linux it feels like you can leave your computer up for a long time now obviously it also depends on whether or not you're running a you know a desktop linux you know computer or a server because they're different things right so that's my question i don't even know the answer if there is an answer because right now my computer has been oh that's i can actually show you this and that'll give you a a, a, a sneak peek at my rice that I've been working on. It's not done yet, but it's, you know, it's getting there. So this is my desktop right now. And up in here in my bar, I have the start time or the uptime. I'm at 101 hours. So, you know, that's what, what, a little bit over three days, something like that. I don't know, maybe close to four days. Uh, but, you know, that's how long it's been since I restarted my computer. And I always tend to get to the point of around 120 hours, and then I restart my computer. It, it just feels like that's the time for me to do it. So my question to you in the comments below, uh, I have two things that I want to know from you. What's the longest you've ever had your desktop Linux computer be up in terms of uptime? And what is your uptime right now? I'd love to know. Uh, just as an, you know, an experiment. So in the comments below, let me know those two things. The, the f interesting thing is that Android, I don't know if you can actually see this or not. Uh, on your Android phone, which is based on Linux, I feel like that has to be started more often than actual Linux. And that's probably because of the Google nonsense. But I, I've always found that over time, Android slows down without a restart. And oftentimes you actually have to nuke and pave your phone in order to actually get it to actually be up and running smoothly again. Because otherwise it just feels like it slows down over time. Maybe it's because as they do up, you know, version updates or whatever, the phones become less capable of running the OS. I don't know. But you don't seem to have that problem on Linux. But I don't know. It's just one of those questions that I've thought about for a while I put I think I put up a poll a few months ago about the whole uptime thing I just wanted to make a video about it it's a useless video it's a useless weekend you know I'm just I'm just chilling out there's not gonna be a stream tomorrow just to let everybody know I'm not doing anything tomorrow other than drinking some beer and watching some fireworks that's um, the American way yeehaw <laughs> and now I gotta apologize to everybody in the south again great all right anyways <laughs> that is it for us on this video i hope everybody no matter where you are has a wonderful weekend if you're in the united states happy fourth uh regular service will resume on term in terms of videos on monday monday probably yeah monday so make sure you subscribe like comment follow all that kind of stuff you can follow me on twitter at linuxcast support me on patreon patreon.com slash linuxcast before I go, I'd like to take a moment to thank my current patrons, Devon, Marcus, Maglin, Donnie, Sven, East Coast Web, Mitchell, Chris, uh, Chris, I believe, has also upped his contributions, so thank you, Chris. Uh, American Camp, thanks everybody for watching. I'll see you next time.